Mary Magdalene's heart is filled with joy because of her friendship with Jesus. She is the first to see the risen Lord. And in Mary, we have proof that Jesus is the friend who restores, the friend who sees us not for who we are, but for who we might be, who we could be, the friend who heals us and sets us free, the friend who knows our name. And Jesus wants us to be the kind of friend that reaches out to people when they're broken. Boy, it's hard to do in, in a world where we celebrate what's good and bright and popular on Facebook and on social media, that when someone's broken, it's just easy sometimes to turn away. But from Jesus and from Simon, we can learn that real friendship reaches into the broken moments of life and the broken people. That's where real friendship is forged. The thing is, if we call on the friend of Jesus, the enemy will flee. And we are richer for having done that together as a group of friends that support each other in times that are desperate, broken, and difficult. Jesus is the giver of life. We see that in Jairus' story. Here's Jesus, he doesn't get mad at the way that Jairus has been. He just follows him to the house and he gives life. It just gives life, that's Jesus. It's never too late to introduce yourself, your friends, your family to the Jesus who saves, to the friend who gives life. The important thing is to do it.